close your eyes. And since this is going to be a short meditation, be really strict with yourself. You're going to stay with the breath. Any thoughts that leave the breath, you're going to let them go. You're not going to look into them. You're not going to get engaged with them at all. Just hold on to the breath coming in, breath coming out. Maintain that intention. Because we have good intentions and bad intentions in our minds. And we want to recognize the good ones when they come and hold on to them. Otherwise, we start holding on to things that are going to pull us down. And you wonder why. Why do we do this? We know that greed, aversion, and delusion are bad for us, yet we hold on to them anyhow. You have to look into that. But first you've got to have something better to hold on to, otherwise the mind feels adrift. It feels lost. So you hold on to the breath. If you need a meditation word to go with the breath, use butto, but in, to, out. It means awake. That's the quality of mind you want to develop. You want to be awake to what's going on. Otherwise, something comes in, floods the mind, and you find yourself doing something you wouldn't have thought of doing. And you know, part of you knows better, but you do it anyhow. It's that getting flooded that you have to watch out for. That's a lapse in mindfulness. And then when the mindfulness isn't there, then you can do anything. Mindfulness is to remind you, this is where these things lead. Greed doesn't lead to a good place. Anger doesn't lead to a good place. Delusion doesn't lead to a good place. They pull you down. You want to be able to remember the whole story as things begin to start. You'd say, I know where this is going. I know where that's going. I don't have to look into that old movie anymore. I've got better things to do. That helps pull you out. So try to strengthen the mindfulness that allows you to stay with the breath, regardless of what else comes flooding in. That's your lifeline. Otherwise you get swept away. The world is swept away and you get swept away with it. You don't know where you're going to get washed up on shore someplace, so a little desert island someplace or some really poor place. You don't want that. You want to, If you get swept away, you want to be swept away to something good, but you can't really trust the swipe sweeping away. You have to depend on your own efforts to go to someplace good, rather than just Resign yourself to the currents. You see something good and you go for it. Hold on to that attention. Otherwise you just don't go with the flow. You sometimes have to go against the flow if you want to find something that's really good. So the meditation gives you a good solid place to stay so that you don't get swept away. Once you have a good, solid place to stay, then your goodness has a solid place to stay. And that gives it a chance to really grow and establish itself. <laughs>